We were actually looking yeah. at properties, and we saw a property that we really liked, and she was outside. Mm -hmm. She had her table set up, and she was working with that particular... Yeah, we, we were just looking around for houses, and so there's some houses for construction in Arlington. And Carrie was selling the houses, so we went up to her, asked to see the houses. She took us in, and we told her we were interested in selling our house at some point. So she said, well, you know, would you consider me? And we had already talked to a number of real estate agents before that. And I think, you know, Carrie, her professionalism and her friendly nature, you know, sometimes those don't combine that well, but she really has a, has a rare combination of that. And that struck us. So then we remembered her, and then we really decided to put her house on the market. We, uh, we called her on the phone. Um, been to the, the process a number of times. Um, this was my first time selling a house here, though, in Virginia. So I bought one house in Virginia and a townhouse and uh, then she was helping us sell that house. Okay, well, so what were you looking for? You said you interviewed a couple of different realtors, but you said like maybe they were too friendly and not really like business oriented, or maybe they were too business oriented and didn't really understand some of your needs. Actually, one of the, I can say one in particular, I, I liked her a lot personally, but her approach was a little, she was a little, she kind of put her judgments on us. She kind of like yeah. talked about particular neighborhoods and well, I like this, I like that. Right. You guys should like, you know, you'd like this, you'd like that, you know, and I felt like she wasn't giving us a chance to check out the neighborhoods ourselves or, you know, make that decision for ourselves. She was kind of like putting us in a box and deciding this would be best for you and this won't work for you. And that was kind of frustrating versus Carrie was really open-minded and she was really listening to what we like and what we were looking for. We wanted to um, time the selling of the house with the purchasing of the new house pretty close together for obvious reasons. So it took us a while to find a house we wanted to buy. And, and deciding if we were positively going to sell, too, because we were That's renovating right. our house. That's right. And Which we loved the renovation, but after kind of getting up there, finding this house, we yeah. kind of, yeah. So, was, so then we called Carrie, and she uh, quickly came by. Uh, and I think what particularly struck us about Carrie was she had, she had a very clear philosophy of how to sell. And she was very clear about why she had that philosophy and why it would work. And it, it made sense, um, and it was very clear, um, and she helped us implement that, flow, that that concept, and it worked, and it worked amazingly well. It, a lot of it was the pricing, right? Because I think um, one thing I found from uh, dealing with real estate before has been a lot of times real estate agents will, will advise you to go for as much as much you possibly get, right? And what Carrie made a point of well, is in this market, that may not be wise, right? Because it's a buyer's market. So what you really want to do is price your, 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 your house such that it makes people want, want to bid on it. So you could end up in a bidding war, basically. And, you know, I, I, we were talking about that. How do you get a bidding war in this market? And we actually had three offers on the house. And it really was a bidding war. And Carrie was exactly right. So she looked at the comps, we discussed the comps, um, and we discussed what the, the asking price should be. Uh, we agreed on that. And then we agreed on how we'd stage the house. That was another key part of it, right? You know, the staging of the house. How do you make it look such that someone wants to buy this house? And we did that. She had great input. Based on what I've heard from other people who have had staging help from their realtors, it can get kind of out of control. And You need to buy this, you need to do that. She really helped us work with what we had, you know, and, and just with minimal adjustments that we really were surprised that this is our house, you know, this is our stuff. Yeah. And it was... She just made great suggestions, and she was, like I said, she was just always very positive and very helpful, and always making us feel listened to, and that was yeah. huge. Very, just that was just huge for us. I feel like we were a really great team with Carrie. Yeah. I mean, she yeah. was just, yeah. you guys. I think this. We're like, okay, we talk about it. We feel this. She's okay. She take it into consideration. Well, then why don't we do this? And we're like, you know, that's right. We. We found something that made us all happy, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. that was what was great. And the negotiations took like what? Well, let's see. I mean, we had a she scheduled an open house, and I think that next week we had an offer. Uh, then she called some other folks who were interested, and said there's an offer. And then we got another offer, and then we get a third offer. And uh, this is all I think within a week after the first open house. Um, and then uh, there were a couple of things we had to deal with after that. But in a matter of two or so weeks, maybe three, um, the, con the, the contract was signed. Yeah, the actual yeah. setting of the, okay, these people are in, that was like a couple of days, yeah. right? She yeah. said, these people want it now, but then two days we were like, okay, yeah. you know, it was great. 
And she, she does it's interesting, right? So one of the things she, she says is that, you know, we don't sell it in at 90 days or something like that. Um, her, her services are free, right? That's quite a risk she's taking. But then she also said her goal was to sell it in, in 30 days. And again, in this market, I think we were a little bit hesitant to actually believe that. Um, but she did it. What we ended up doing actually was having a rent back period with the folks who bought this house for it. And that worked out fine. So we actually, I think, we, we actually worked out very well. Because we ended up selling this house the day we were supposed to move, selling the house we were in the day we were supposed to move into this house. Perfect. Oh yeah. my goodness. Wow. Yeah. Sounds like it worked out really well. She, really she kept all that in mind all the time, too. She knew all of that, and it was really, you know, she was. She was great. <laughs> <laughs> she really was. I mean, like, you know, it's funny because we, when we first met her, we like he said we weren't positive yet what we were gonna do, but she just kept in our minds and Reggie more than anyone because he's the one that's really been you know in real estate. I hadn't really been in this arena before, but he just kept saying, you know, I like Carrie. I really like her. I, yeah. There's something about her that is really. It was her professionalism, but she was so easy to talk to, and she was very cool and and yeah. you know. It was just, it, it, she just stuck with us, so we were like, we just kept coming back to, yeah, it, we'd meet other people because we'd go look at other properties or whatever, and they're like, well, let me help you sell your home, and we considered it, but then we just kept coming back. It was like, well, if we really want to do it, let's just go back to Carrie, because she was just across the board the best candidate. Actually, it made me think about something. For a while, we weren't even going to have a real to represent us at all, because we didn't want to pay the percentage. And so we talked to a number of realtors, and I kept saying, you know, we don't really need this person to help us, given what they're saying. But just talking to Carrie and understanding what she was going to provide, it really made us realize, yeah, we really do need her to help us sell this house. Well, she made it easy. I have to admit, yeah. he's the guy that, he's the house buyer seller. I was not so, I was like, oh gosh, what are we getting into? She made it very easy. And I mean, I really like Carrie. She made it very easy. And I, I would do it again. <laughs> I, I think I made it harder because I was trying to stay involved when I had to. So it was. She made it very easy, and she was trying to keep us from doing anything. And I just, I'm used to being very hands-on, and she was fine with that. Mm -hmm. But I, it didn't even have to be that hard. I could have just let her just, you know, just go with it. We Which have one? already. Yeah, we have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. We head up her fan club. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>